It looks like uh, we're in for a little bit of a warm-up, at least. Uh, perfect head outdoors, and maybe next week, catch them trout even. Yeah, catch them right behind you, Rod. Okay. <laughs> Carpenter's Brook Fish Hatchery has been busy stocking the rivers across Onondaga County before trout season. News Channel 9's meteorologist Lindsay Rachel shows us all the different kinds of trout the county has to offer. Get a good shot. Beautiful. Just happened to be out here and seeing them throwing them in here. Onondaga County is unique in the fishing industry because it operates one of only four county run hatcheries in all of New York State, stocking over 100 miles of streams in the county with trout. I assumed it was being stocked, but I didn't know it was from Carpenter's Brook, and it's just fun to be here at the right time. If we didn't stock Onondaga County, I think the fishing would definitely suffer. Uh, Green Lakes would not get the 7,000 fish that it gets annually. Want to grab that big one, Travis? This is just one of 85,000 fish that Carpenter's Brook Fish Hatchery stocks annually. Fish on. And it all begins right here in Elbridge. Brook trout are the only fish native to New York, and it's actually our state fish. And it's one of our prettiest fish, I think. So they have these blue and red spots on their side, but the real distinguishing features are the white tips on all the bottom fins. So on all of their fins along their belly, they got white stripes along those tips. That's the easiest way to distinguish those fish. As for the brown trout, they aren't from New York, but they've done really well in these waters. Brown trout have red and black spots on their sides. They got brown, like mustard colored brown on their on their cheeks. So you kind of see the color. Remember we were talking about the white markings on the brook trout? Right. They don't have that. We've seen the brook trout, the brown trout, and now we're gonna see the rainbow trout. Rainbow trout are, have been called that because of the red and the green. So you can see the red on her back, the green down her side, and the white on her belly. So that's where that comes from. Spots all the way from the tip of her nose to the tip of her tail. Whether you're in it for the challenge of hooking one on your line or you just love their beauty, there's plenty of fish to go around. Lindsay Rachel, News Channel 9. They're really uh, stocking the streams there yeah, pretty good yeah. this year. Just a, a shout out to photo, photojournalist Mark Folsom. Just a beautiful job shooting that. Yeah. So uh, trout season starts Monday. Monday. Yeah. Make sure you stay tuned for the forecast. Lindsay, of course, will have forecast updates throughout the weekend and also lo local SWire.com. I hope the weather holds okay. out. And yeah. if you want to learn more about the events at the hatchery and what they're hosting, head to local SWire.com. And still